MPD says the goal in releasing this first full report is full transparency. But as Katie Crowther shows us, improvements are still needed to get there. This 44 page report has a lot of information, everything from crime numbers to police response times, but we received it after the police department and the mayor's office held a press conference touting what this contains. This is where people can find all those answers about what are we doing? But we couldn't see those answers or ask any specific questions while face to face with leaders because we didn't get the report until 30 minutes after everyone left. They say that was by design and look forward to questions. Look at it, digest it, give us feedback that there is something we should be improving on. The Milwaukee Police Department is making significant strides to be a good partner. And to do that, we've got to be forthright and transparent. That's a big part of what today's uh, report is about. The community report shows that in the first five months of 2022, homicides in Milwaukee are up 39% from 2021, which saw a record number of homicides. Carjackings are up 10% and non-fatal shootings up 6% over last year. On the other hand, the report indicates other violent crime and reckless driving have begun to decline in 2022. Look, nobody is sugarcoating the fact that we've got uh, continuing public safety issues that we're facing uh, in Milwaukee. But the mayor and police chief invite the public to look beyond the statistics provided and get involved in some of the solutions listed. While many residents we spoke with plan to. Anything I can do to help the community, I will definitely love to be a part of. Others are honest that much more action by leaders is needed as crime plagues their neighborhoods. I see it so many so many times and it's just scary to go out. I don't think no one's doing enough. Oh, I think it's just getting worse. I, I feel like we're kind of alone. Like we got to deal with it alone. You can read through this entire MPD community report for yourself at TMJ4.com. For now, live in Milwaukee, Katie Crowther, TMJ4 News.